People in South Georgia are bracing for the first impacts of the storm that we'll see here in our state. At Love and Alive's Angelina Salcedo is live for us in Valdosta right now. And Angelina, you're at a shelter where some people will be riding out the storm tonight. And this shelter is one of three that happens to be in the Valdosta area. It is an evacuation shelter being put on by the Red Cross, which basically means that people, if they feel unsafe, they can come here, ride out Hurricane Helene, and then they can leave once conditions are safe. I want you to take a look at what it looks like inside. This shelter has started to fill up slowly since opening at 2 this afternoon. There are families from all around Lons County here tonight. Some live far, others live close, but they were concerned concerned by the conditions that are expected here. The Red Cross making sure that they can do all that they can to make sure that people feel comfortable. Mobile showers are in place. People can use those up until 530. They just want people to feel good while waiting out this storm. They come in to stay here for the evening. Uh, we have snacks ready for them. This church, Park Avenue, has been so gracious. I see they already have a television set up for children. They're watching movies. Uh, they're having a, a nice, comfortable place to stay for the evening. And many people that I spoke to inside tell me that they are just blessed to have a safe place for them to go. A lot of them, again, worried about those conditions as we start to feel winds come into this area. This is the third time that Valdosta has been hit by some kind of storm since Idalia passed through back in August of last year. The typical thing that they experience here is down trees and down power lines. That's why people that come here, they say that they're not going to take any chances. They just want to make sure that they are safe. We're live tonight in Valdosta. Angelina Salcido, 11 live news.